I'm here to talk about a film called Jumanji um, that I'm thrilled to be part of. Um, Dwayne The Rock Johnson, Kevin Hart, Jack Black, Karen Gillan, myself, go on an epic adventure in the jungles of Jumanji, which is not a board game anymore in this film, but a video game that we get sucked into. Uh, and, well, they do, and then you find me later on in the film, and we help each other complete this game, uh, and it's a, a great ride for the audience. Action-packed and uh, full of some, some great comedy as well. This is the first time I've attended Comic-Con. My brother goes with my father pretty much every year uh, in California. In San Diego. Uh, yeah, in San Diego, and he loves it. Um, but this would be my first time, and I'm, I'm excited, really excited for it. I think the fans can expect uh, to learn about the film and to get excited to see it, hopefully. Uh, but also, you know, it, this is, I think, what I've heard about Comic-Con and what I'm excited to see myself is that it seems like it's a celebration of uh, being a fan of something. And, uh, you know, starting with um, comic books and obviously graphic novels and, and um, films that, that uh, celebrate that world. Uh, but also films that have become uh, a part of the, the culture of people's lives and the fabric of people's lives, like Jumanji, the original, and uh, now this, this new Jumanji adventure. I think it's, it's a really exciting opportunity to kind of take, um, you know, films that people love and, and stories that people love and, and elevate them and bring them to life. I will be making a visit at Sony's booth. Uh, which will be a lot of fun. Excited to see the fans of this film, my fans, and uh, just the, the great people of Brazil. I might need a costume if I was just going to walk around, uh, but that's the, the beauty of uh, Comic-Con, is you can kind of throw on a you know, Stormtrooper outfit and so, <laughs> be so good so to go. A Stormtrooper or Deadpool or... Uh, you know, maybe Spider-Man, any one of those would work. I didn't really dress up this year for Halloween because I was actually in Montreal shooting a movie where I was dressed up. But I think actually my, <laughs> my character in the movie I'm doing might be a future Comic-Con outfit. It's very different being here promoting a movie uh, to performing. You know, you kind of spend the whole day when you're here for music, sort of setting up the show that night, then you get to perform. Whereas this, you know, the, the, the work's already done. As in the performance is already done because it's the movie you're promoting. Uh, so it's, it's kind of fun to, to come and just get people excited about the film, talk about what else I've got going on, and uh, have the chance to, to be here in this beautiful city. You know, any chance I get to come here to Sao Paulo, to Rio, Porto, Alegre, you know, I, I always love those opportunities. There's definitely something special about the Brazilian fans. You know, they, they are so passionate, and, and online, uh, they're one of my biggest presences as far as my social media platforms go. Um, you know, Sao Paulo is actually one of the biggest cities for me on, on Instagram. Uh, and so I think, you know, it's, it's a really special time to, to come here and see them and, and show them love that they've been showing me uh, through social media. It's tough to talk to them because it's always uh, insanity, you know, and, and uh, it's a very short amount of time between the, the car and the plane and everything else. But um, I, I, I try to show them as much love as I can in those sort of isolated moments. But the shows here have always been amazing uh, and some of my favorites.